behold! Hello, Orc fans. The Stomper has been finished. Uh, in fact, he's been finished for a while now. I've just not had uh, an opportunity really to record. Well, I, I did, but well, we won't go into that. I did record it, but anyway, here's the finished Stomper, um, which I'm quite proud of. Um, best thing I ever painted gets banded around a lot these days, but it probably probably getting closer. Well, it's only the biggest thing I've ever painted. Uh, so I'm quite proud of him, quite happy with him now. Uh, not used him in any games yet. But hopefully, hopefully we'll get that resolved fairly soon and record some games with him in and uh, get them up for you to watch. If you can see in the corner there, I'm trying to keep him out of shot, but there's Richard's working on a little project over there of his own. So I'll just give him a little leather spin. There's the little evil sons symbol logo I painted on there. A lot of damage. Quite pleased with how the uh, chain, whatever it's called, chainsaw arm came out with the little damage, battle damage on that. Yeah, there we go. Um, lots of damage all over him, rust and all that sort of stuff, typhus corrosion, little glyphs on the back there. There's my sort of orc mech or whoever he is I stuck on the back, finished. I'll just try and focus the camera a little bit better. There we go, there he is. And these little glyphs, the other Gretchen, the other little one I added on the bottom there, hanging on for dear life. The chimneys with a little bit of smoke on them, the rockets and the big gun. I tried to do a little bit of burnt metal, burnt sort of steel colour on that Gatling gun. Smoke on the end of the cannon there. There's the orc sitting on top of the stomper, firing both his guns. Uh, and he's on, I don't know if you've seen the previous video, here we go, he's focused now, but I um, magnetised him, so I'll just give me a second. Oh, his head comes off. <laughs> Brilliant. Welcome back. Crisis averted. Uh, here's the more uh, relaxed orc with just with one gun and his cigar arm. Um, I'll try not to drop him again now, which found that hilarious. Uh, yeah, so the head was magnetised as well, again if you hadn't seen the original other videos check those out. But the head's magnetised so it can sort of turn but it sort of stays fairly secure. Except when you tug at the orc's arm obviously. Um, and he can also come off and uh, there should be a lid there but the lid has presumably gone missing as well. Anyway, so yeah, stick him on the top there so he's got the option of a couple of guns. Quite proud of this little um, totem pole thing up there as well. Oh yeah, there we go, there's the lid. Um, the totem pole, all the cross hatching stuff on done on there. So yeah, there's my uh, stomper, quite proud of him. As I said, not used him in battle yet, but I'm looking forward to see the devastation he can uh, unleash all his guns. And then yeah, look over there, there's a little project he's working on. So, uh, stay tuned guys for more bat reps coming up very shortly and hopefully you'll see the Stomper make his debut in the battle. Thanks for watching and stay tuned. Oh, he's had